superstar first graders welcome to your new grade one learning journey and new video we'll discover fantastic stories participate in exciting activities and learn interesting information together on this beautiful adventure so put on your explorer hats because every day is a treasure of knowledge waiting to be found in this weekly video, we will learn to spell long I words, words that contain I-G-H. On Monday, we will learn about the long I words, again, words that contain I-G-H, and we'll be learning about the suffixes E-R or O-R. On Tuesday, we'll continue learning about the body systems, and we will continue reading the story inside your body. On Wednesday, we'll be learning about transitions and conjunctions. And on Thursday, we will learn how to construct an informational paragraph. The spelling words for this week are words that contain I-G-H in them. I-G-H make a long I sound. And the spelling words for this week are high, sight, might, light, and bright. Now let's use them in sentences. I had a very high fever. I can't stand the sight of blood. Tom might win the race. Turn off the light. Bright stars shone out here and there in the sky. So we'll be learning about the long I spelled I-G-H. The letters I-G-H make a long I sound as in tight. So let's read these words. Any word that contain I-G-H will make a long I sound. So we have bright and sigh. We have tight, bright, night, thigh, high, light, and night. So again, the letters I-G-H make the long I sound. In phonics, we'll be learning about suffixes that end with E-R or O-R. A suffix is a word part added to the end of a word to make a new word. The suffixes E-R and O-R mean one who. Reader means one who reads. Sailor means one who sails. So again, suffixes ER and OR mean one who. In this week, we'll be reading the informational book titled Inside Your Body. Inside Your Body teaches you about the wonders of the human body. It explains the various systems that keep the body functioning like an amazing machine from the skeletal system to the digestive system and more. The objective is to use the reading strategy of asking and answering questions and to identify the main ideas and details. In grammar, we'll be learning about transitions and conjunctions. Transition words and conjunctions are used to connect two ideas. First, next, then, and last are transition words. But, so, and, or, and because are conjunctions. First, we walked to the park, then we played on the swings and went down the slide. We had fun because we played together. Now let's use the words in the box to complete these sentences. We have conjunctions and transitions. First, Lucy and I played basketball. Then, we wanted to see a movie, but we were too tired. So, we decided to have a snack. 